Hey y'all, hey y'all, hey y'all. We have a kind of strange setup today. Um, I realize uh, just now I should probably probably move you guys a little bit. I'm gonna move you guys to this side. Even though you can't see it, but I can see it. It is invisible. <laughs> But things seem to be working today, which is really good. It's good when things work. <laughs> um, but I'm I'm just I'm just glad I'm just glad everything seems to be going fine. I hope that things will stay this way because that'd be good. Because <laughs> I want to do karaoke after this if I can. But for now we will be exploring some forests together i have some videos downloaded of different forests and we're gonna we're gonna go through them together so here we go hope everyone having a good day by the way but let's check it out oh <gasps> dragon thunder welcome thank you for the raid we're we're going through some some forests together exploring because I love I love going through forests and parks and stuff, but I know as a virtual being I can't obviously can't uh, take you guys along, so this is my way of doing that. Hello, big cheese, welcome. What we're exploring right now, by the way, is a it's Todoroki Valley in uh, Tokyo, Japan. So it's in the middle of the city, but it's still a nice little foresty area. Yeah, I hope everyone having a good day today. I'd be a little scared to walk on this. Because <laughs> I'd be like, oh no, it's going to be slippery from the rain. But luckily it's got, it's got handrails, so I can, I can grab onto it if I need to. And it's got a very pretty river. It's nice that you can have, like, forests like this when you're, when you're in the city, I guess. Are we working? Yeah, we're working. We have our umbrella, and and it's protecting us from the rain, so we can still still explore nice nice area. Ooh, I'd be so scared to go under this bridge. <laughs> ooh. I know it's safe. It's built to be safe, but I'm still I'm still pretty ooh when it comes to like building stuff. It looks so pretty. It does. Is that a green traffic cone? I've never seen a green traffic cone before. I wonder if different colored traffic cones mean different things? We shall see, I guess. Or maybe they're just different in different countries. I like that there's these little, like, information areas, though. I can't read it, because I can't read Japanese. <laughs> but it's still nice. Kind of tropical. I didn't expect it to, cause it's got those like palm, palm leaf kind of things around. I've only seen those kinds of things in like the south. So I don't know where Tokyo is in comparison to other places or like uh, United States at least, cause like Florida and Texas are like at the bottom of the United States, and like. Maine would probably be the t the tippiest top, aside from like Alaska, of course. I wonder where in between, what is it, lati latitude, longitude? Yeah, longitude wise. I wonder where Tokyo is. But I like the little pathway. It looks like I think it's wood. I think it's a wood path. And you're right next to the river. It's kind of scary that there's no guardrail. <laughs> believe I believe in our ability to stay standing <laughs> and that we won't fall in that's so nice though I haven't gone for a walk in the rain in a long time but I love the rain which is kind of weird because a lot of people like the sunlight because I'm pretty sure science wise sunlight like releases dopamine or something sunlight helps you sunlight is healthy for you 
I don't know about rain. I've never really... Rain obviously helps all the plants and stuff. But hi, Cliff. <laughs> Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day today. We're just doing a comfy walk through a park in Tokyo. I think there's a little bench. It'd probably be really nice on a sunny day to just sit on the bench and watch the water go by. I really like doing that. Like the this sounds this makes me sound really old. <laughs> but the more that I uh, I guess age or the, the longer time goes on, the more I come to appreciate like just looking at stuff. <laughs> Just watching the rain, watching the trees, watching the river, watching even like cars go by. Oh no, there's a tree that fell. It still looks very green though, so it must have really fallen. So they have to go up with very interesting. Thank you, thank you for popping in. Hope you have a good rest of your day and thank you for your hard work. Is that another? Wait, is that a bridge? Are we gonna cross? Or is that just a wall? Oh, that looks like... Yeah, it looks like it ends over here. I love the one tree in the middle of the sidewalk. <laughs> just like, hmm, I really decided not to cut this one down when we were paving it. <laughs> oh. God, even the bridge doesn't have handrails. That's kind of scary, but it also looks really pretty. And like, you really gotta trust in your ability not to freak out and fall over. <laughs> oh, it looks so nice. I'd love to hang out here. Like, if I lived by this, oh, I'd go for a walk, a walk, like, every day. Although, I don't know, I don't know how temperatures are in Tokyo. Because I hear that Japan can get really hot in the summer. I mean, obviously, anywhere in the summer it gets hot. I don't know quite the extent of how bad it is. I love the little extra river. I hope we're wearing boots, because that would have made our feet seem really wet. <laughs> like when it's raining, I don't know if anybody is anybody else is like this, but I like to wear sandals if I have sandals. I currently don't own sandals. It's been years since I've owned sandals. <laughs> but when I lived in a really rainy place whenever it was um, like raining like this I would always go out in sandals because um, it's easy to just wash off my feet oh, I had to restart the camera <laughs> but um yeah, because obviously if you wear shoes and your shoes are made of cloth they're gonna get all wet and that's not fun because shoes take forever to dry like I don't know if it's just the types of shoes I have but the shoes take forever ever <laughs> to dry but it's probably because there's like all the different layers and stuff i don't know but it's definitely easier to um to just dry off sandals or like dry off your feet sees. i do want to get sandals again because it is summertime where i am and i've been really thinking about getting sandals it's been a long time since i've had them but I like, I like having sandals, so that my, my feetsies can breathe <laughs> in the, uh, in the summer. Also, let me know if the sound is a bit off. I tested it beforehand and it seemed okay, but if I'm a bit too quiet and, or like the rain's a bit too loud, just let me know and I'll adjust it. This kid is going wild. <laughs> He's like, I'm just gonna sit in the wet, and the dad's like, no, don't sit in the puddle. <laughs> wow, there's even a wall. So there's a little, little tiny waterfall here. And you really need boots to walk in this area. Very pretty though. I like the like, waterfalls and streams. Like there's something about running water that is like kind of peaceful 
Like, obviously, when it's like this, it's a little, little much, because it's, it's it's roaring waters. So it makes me think of, like, a water park. I don't think, I don't think I've ever been to a water park, now that I think about it. Oh, are we gonna go in this part? Nah, just looking. It's weird that this part has, like, a little fence, but then there's another part that's even closer to the river that doesn't have a fence. Oh, more green traffic cones. I, not gonna lie, I really like these green traffic cones. They're, I don't know, maybe it's because they're vibrant? Or, I don't know, maybe because green is a cooler color? But I'm, I'm liking that, I'm liking that. <laughs> I also love the random rocks just in the sidewalk. Definitely, like, what I really like about that is like, yeah, the rocks and like trees and the sidewalk, yeah, it gets in the way. But it's nice when humans have an area that they've claimed from nature, obviously. But they still keep a little bit of nature of where it's supposed to be. I like that. Like, I don't like... Like, you know those parks where they absolutely clear out all of the trees? Uh, like, obviously, yeah, now we have room for, like, festivals or playing the sports. But I... I really like when it has all the trees and it has all the, the bushes and stuff. <gasps> what is that box? Oh, a triple box? That looks nice. <laughs> is there a tiny river on the other side? <gasps> Mini river! I hope everyone's in enjoying, enjoying the coziness of the, of the rain. I, I personally really like it. I think it's very nice. But if I was... If I was walking through this myself, I'd probably like stop to look at a bunch of the plants. Probably because I've never been to that kind of area before, so a lot of these plants are really new to me. Like, I'm seeing a lot of really cool, like, leaf shapes and stuff. I don't know if that's nerdy to say. <laughs> like, ooh, wow, look at this leaf shape. <laughs> like, I think it's really neat. Like, I, I've said it, I think, plenty of times, but I love nature. I think it's so fascinating, so cool, which is why I wanted to do one of these things. I know it's not the most exciting because I'm not like playing a game like Yakuza where I'm beating people up or whatever. But I feel like it's nice just to hang out like this and just, you know, like explore. Like I love seeing new places. Oh, <gasps> is this bridge like, actually made of like trees around here? I love that. Instead of just being like planks or like, what is... What is treated wood called? I don't remember. But I like that they actually use, like, I guess the only way I know to put it is, like, raw trees. <laughs> but I like that they use, use it like that instead of, like, cut, like, cut planks and stuff. It just looks nicer. It looks more natural. Ooh, is that a neck? But it seems kind of like a straight path, so I don't think we're going to get lost. We'll be okay. But make sure you stay under your own path so you don't get away. I don't want to- I don't want us catching a cold after this. <laughs> I hope it's a really big umbrella. I've always wanted a clear umbrella, but I don't really- I feel like they're not- that popular in the US. Like, I love that you can, you can, like, look up and see everything. But I also, I don't know how effective it is against... Well, I guess when it's raining, you don't really have to worry about the sun. Is that a secret path over there? Secret path through Tokyo. <laughs> God, I love the little, like, stone. On the side of the the walk. God, this is so nice. Cause usually paths that I go on, 
are you either strictly cement, tar, or it's just a dirt path? The problem with dirt, obviously, is like there's like uh, roots and stuff in Trigon. <gasps> this is a little shrine. There's like a little rest area. Is that Buddha I see? It's very dark. I cannot tell. I think that's Buddha. I'm gonna pray at the shrine. I hope I hope everyone in chat has a good day today. <laughs> <laughs> that is my prayer. <laughs> oh, it's so nice. Oh my god, these leaves on the left. Oh, I love those. I love like pointed leaves for some reason. I don't know why. But they look really neat. Maybe it's because I just live in an area that has a lot of, like, rounder kind of leaves. So whenever I see, like, pointy ones, I'm like, ooh, it's different. <laughs> Crazy. Oh, it's so nice. Oh, it's a little area. Oh my god. Is that one of those, like, noodle slide things? I don't know. Is it just, like, a little... Huh. I like that. I don't know what it is, but it looks like a little cute creature. I like them. I would drink from that. <laughs> I just scoop my hand in and just. <laughs> oh, there's some orange around. I wonder if it's near fall or if it's just a naturally orange kind of tree. Oh my god, another bridge. Oh, this bridge is really pretty. Like, yeah, this one is less natural because it's obviously like planks instead. I like the style. Kind of like, kind of like the bridge you can have an Animal Crossing, I think. Is that another shrine? Oh my gosh. I'd love, I'd love if just like paths around here have like shrines or something. Because as far as I know, in the United States, we don't really have these kinds of things. We just have- we just kind of carved paths through, like, the forest. And that's it. We don't really- we don't pretty it up or anything. Oh my god, these lanterns are so pretty. Oh my god. What is that? It's like a bowl in there? What's that for? I'm so curious. That is so pretty, though. Have a good day again. <laughs> Whatever deity rests here. God, this is so nice. It's just a, it's such a small little area, but it's so beautiful. I wonder what that little house thing is with the cups in it. I wonder what that is. at first I thought it was like a little, I don't know, maybe like a little house for like butterflies or something, so that you can like raise them. Thank you for the follow, kitten girl, welcome in, hope you're having a good day today. We're just doing a chill adventure together. We're going through a park in Tokyo, and it's been, it's been gorgeous so far, I love it. Be careful in the stairs, guys. Because it's, it's pretty wet from the rain. So we gotta go nice and slow so we don't fall. And we'll, we'll hold on to the rail if we need to. God, I love these lamps, though. They're so nice. How are you doing? Thank you. How are you doing? I'm doing really good. I'm so glad that I get to stream this with you guys today. I've been so excited for this. I was gonna stream this last night, but my internet wasn't good enough. So I had to postpone, so I'm so happy. I'm so happy I finally got around to this. Do we have another little another little area? <gasps> A crab! A crab in the middle of Tokyo? Are there forest crabs? 
Oh, I kind of want to look. Oh, another little shrine. Oh my god. There's a broom too, so you can clean it if you want to. Oh my god, that's so nice. Hold on. I want to Google forest crabs. <laughs> because I only know crabs to be like, obviously, like, um, ocean, like by the ocean. Let's see, are there forests? Forest crabs. Or maybe, maybe this river goes all the way to the ocean so that the crab hitched her eye. There are types of crabs that live in forests, including hermit crabs, mangrove crabs, and red crabs. <gasps> I didn't know there was forest crabs. That's wild. I love all the little shrines. There's so many. So many places to like have a little prayer. So pretty. Oh, we got an orange traffic cone. I wonder, I wonder what the green ones mean then. You know what? I'm gonna Google that too while I'm at it. You guys, you guys keep going. Don't worry about me. Let's see. Green traffic cone. Nah. Temporary or alternative routes or work site entrances. Ah, because there was that tree that fell, so maybe that's why there was the green cones, because it did have like a sign on it, but I don't, I don't know Japanese, so I couldn't read it. Is this like a whole area to like relax? Oh my god, I hope so, it's so pretty. Rain Japan, yes. God, I want to visit Japan. I don't have a passport though, <laughs> and I don't have the money. That's like, I don't know, that's been a goal of mine for a long time. Like when I was really young. <gasps> Is this a dragon fountain? Oh my god, please turn it on. No! <laughs> oh, I want to drink from the dragon fountain. <gasps> Wait. <gasps> Is this one of these? <gasps> Is this one of the areas that like have you can get your fortune and stuff? Oh my god. Oh my god, this is so pretty. Oh god, I love the lanterns so much. I want these lanterns in my house. Oh, there's big brown ones too. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's like it's one of those properties where you put the coin in. And you do the and you do the ding 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 dong. Oh. Oh my gosh. It's so pretty. Oh, what is that pot for? For a fire, maybe? Or like incense? Looks like there's sand inside, or maybe that's ashes. Oh god, this place is so nice. I hang out here all the time, oh my god. And it's so nice that they have, they still have like these trees here. Like they didn't clear out the whole area, like they kept some trees. I love that. Ooh. I feel like we're going through it backwards. I feel like this is the entrance and we went the back way. <laughs> oh, are we gonna head back on a path maybe? Is it a little lookout area? Oh, I hope it's like a cliff or something. I'm like, I'm like peeking over even though I know that's not gonna do anything. Oh, the tree. Oh my god, it's so nice. Such a beautiful day. I know a lot of people wouldn't call a rainy day a beautiful day, but I, I think it's a beautiful day. Because it's not like super, super dark, so you can still see everything. Oh my god, I want to go on the upper part. I know it's closed off, but I would totally want to go on the upper part. <laughs> oh, there's lights down here. Oh, I love, I love the dripping of all the water. It sounds so nice. And I love that the, to close off the areas, they have like these little wooden fences. That's so cute. Because here in America, usually it's like a metal, it's like a metal fence where they'll put like caution tape or something. So it's more like industrial. But having like the little wooden fence to be like, no, don't go up there, that's cute, I like that. That big tree, that's a thick tree. That is a very huggable tree, I'd hug that tree. <laughs> <gasps> oh, 
Ooh, I wonder what that band on the tree means. I wonder if the tree is injured? Or if it's like a marker for something? Cause there's- oh, there's words on the lanterns. I wonder what they say. It'd be funny if it was just like the brand. I'm like, ooh, what does this say? And it's just like the brand of the lamp. <laughs> they look the same, so maybe it is. I feel like it's a lot of text for just a brand though. Although a lot of things are getting longer because as new places pop up, it's hard to uh, have a unique name when um, when there's already a lot of other names in use. <laughs> Gotta be careful down the stairs, nice and steady. We don't want to slip and fall, because if we slip and fall, we're gonna get very hurt. <laughs> easy does it, easy does it. Alright, one last section. There we go. I wonder if we're gonna go back across the bridge? It looks like we probably will. I wonder what that sign says. Oh, no fishing. It looks like a no fishing sign. Maybe it incurred fishing, I don't know. Because it looks like a guy sitting down with like a fishing rod, maybe? It's a bit far away, so I couldn't see it. Alright, back across the bridge. I'm glad we took this pit stop at the shrine. Like, we could have just kept going along the path. But it was nice that we had that little stop. It was very pretty. Now we're back on the path next to the river. It looks like it's really high. Like, I feel like there are probably definitely times where it's lower than this. Oh, this is so nice. What's that area up there? I kind of want to go up. I hope we go up. <laughs> Unless that just like goes into a neighborhood, then we probably won't go up. <gasps> looks like we're going up. We're going uppies. Nope, nope, we're not going uppies, we were tricked. <laughs> Never mind, we're going this way. It's so gorgeous this way though. It's a nice area. Like, this one has a metal front, so it's not as pretty. But at least it's like painted green. And, like, it definitely- I feel like it was painted in dark green, but I feel like this is faded with like sun or something. Because I feel like you wouldn't paint it this light tealish green normally. That looks so nice. It's a lot better than if I just left it. Like the grey steel color. And we're so close to the river. Oh, it's so nice. I wonder what this little area on the right is. Are these just like is it just like a park? Oh, are we gonna go through it? Are we gonna go through it? Oh, oh my god. Wait, that might be a do not enter sign. I see red. Or maybe it's be careful or something. Oh, we're going through it. Oh, there's bamboo. And oh, there are these tiny little trees. Oh my god. That is so cute. Look at all these little trees. I wonder if they're fully grown or if these are baby trees. Because there's stumps here, it looks like. From bigger trees. <gasps> Wait, are those limes? Are these lime trees? I saw fruit. I saw fruit on one. Oh my god, I think they are. Or maybe they're lemons? Because lemons are green before they turn yellow, right? Oh my god. He was, but the sign probably said like not to pick it or something. Oh my god, I'd love to go in a place with fruit trees. Oh yeah, actually I haven't told you guys, but last week I went strawberry picking for the first time. It was so nice. I always thought like when I was a kid that strawberries were like these big bushes. Like, like how blueberry bushes are and then you pick the strawberries off but they're really small like strawberry bushes are really really tiny like they're only maybe like six in six inches tall max strawberries go really close to the ground 
God, I love to have a big garden like this. And hey, look at that tree. That is funky looking. It almost looks like a rock. I wonder what type of tree that is. Oh, I can't tell if that's supposed to be a little pond or if there's just too much rain in that area. It's a bamboo though. I heard bamboo is really hard to take care of because it grows so fast. And it'll just completely take over an area. Oh, I love this. I swear these have to be like lime trees. They're so nice. Oh, I want to go. I want to pick fruits. <laughs> because the um, strawberries I got from strawberry picking, they were so good. Like, they were so soft. I didn't know strawberries could be that soft without being like rotten. <laughs> so, uh, it was so nice. I made strawberry jam out of it, and like, I didn't make, like, the strawberries, they boiled down to like, only a little bit of jam. I only filled up maybe like two-thirds of a mason jar, and it was like $14 of strawberries. <laughs> so it was a really, really expensive jar of, um, strawberry jam that I made. It's so good. Oh, thank you for the follow. Welcome in, Jess Blue. Hope you're having a good day today. We're going on an adventure. Oh, we're going through an area in Tokyo, Japan. And it looks like I'm, I'm so sure that these are like little lime trees. Because I swear I saw limes on a couple of them. Oh, I would love. I would love to go picking if it's allowed. Is that a yellow traffic cone? There are so many different colored traffic cones around here. Green, orange. Oh! Whoa! What is that? That's a really pretty flower. Oh, this area is so nice. Gotta be careful though, because it's stone. And with the rain, it's a little slippery, so we gotta, we gotta go slow. I love this area. Like, I know this area is just rocks, but it's really pretty. Oh, I love, oh, I love this. I love that the rocks are the steps. Like, instead of having, like, cement man-made steps, I have these natural, natural rocks. <gasps> what is this? What does this feel? Can you do things here? Oh, I want to play soccer here. <laughs> oh, I want to play. <gasps> More of the flowers. Oh my god, they're so pretty. They're so like, big. They have such skinny stems. What a funky flower. Very pretty though. I wonder if I can grow them. They're very neat. I like that. I wonder what they smell like. Nice. I'm someone who, if I'm on a walk and I find flowers, I, I always stop to smell the flowers. Man, they're so nice. Oh, there's flowers on the trees, too. Oh, I want to smell them. I hope they smell nice. <laughs> This is a funky little fence. There's metal on the top. That's a little strange. I've never seen that before. Oh, what is this? Oh, are we going back down? I think we're heading back to the river now. Just another, another pit stop at another nice area. This is so nice, though. I can't believe this is in Tokyo. Because when I think of Tokyo, I think of just high-rise buildings, like the skyscrapers and stuff. I would never think that Tokyo would have such like a nice little nature area like this. Oh, sorry, I hit my... I hit my mic with my headphones a little bit. Hope everyone's enjoying the walk, though. I'm enjoying it a lot. <laughs> I love... I love going for walks. I love it. So I really wanted to share that with you guys. 
Because this is exactly how I am when I go for a walk. I'm like, ooh, what's this? Ooh, this is so nice. <laughs> Although I'd probably, like, like, try and touch things myself. I really like this tree that's, like, a little orange. I don't know if it does that naturally, or if it maybe this is recorded near fall. And it's just starting to turn. Oh, I bet this place would look gorgeous in the fall. So nice. Looks like the rain's either letting down a bit, or maybe the trees are covering us so we're not getting hit by as much water. It looks like it's starting to get a little sunnier, so I think the rain's starting to stop. Or lighten up at least. But we'll keep going down the path. I think this goes back to the river. I think, yeah, there it is. I see the river. Alright, back this way. Careful down the steps as usual. Oh, I think we saw that lady go by the other way. She's walking fast. <laughs> she got stuff to do. Oh, I'm gonna go back this way. Ooh, is that a secret path? That dude was like in a full suit. Like he was so ready for it. Oh, there's this area again. I wonder if the little sense is damaged because a tree fell or something. I feel like that's gotta be the only way. Ooh! I love those lamps. <laughs> oh, had to restart. Probably battery. Alright, we're going, looks like we're going back. I wonder if there's a different way. Because I think we're getting towards the end of this one. Because I saved like three, like half hour videos for us to go through so that we could experience like different areas. Oh wait, this is a different path I think. Or did we come this way? I don't remember. Yeah, the rain's just starting to stop. Oh yeah, we've been here before because there's that little little stone guy. I don't know. I don't know if it's supposed to be like the grasshopper or something, but I like him. <laughs> oh, this is so nice. I loved this. This was such a nice area. If I ever Go. I definitely want to go through here. I'd love to experience this, like for real. <laughs> but for now, we'll experience together virtually. Yeah, it looks like we're heading back. Wonder. Okay, yeah, we still got 13 minutes left of this one. So I wonder if we're gonna be taken down a different path that we walked over before. We've definitely been on this part. And then we go down the bridge. Or maybe we're just walking back. Maybe we're just heading home. It seems really nice though. It's nice to see it the other way. Because when I go for a walk, I tend to only really look at my side. I try to look at both, but going back the other way definitely has another feel to it. Yeah, because we crossed that bridge before. Okay, so we're going down here now. It's a little bit of a different place. But I love how much... What is it called? Brush there is? Like all the little tiny plants growing like in the grassy parts. Like it's not just clear area grass and trees. There's all these little... All these little guys. All these little plants. That's so nice. We have been this way before. I can't tell. I have very bad um, location recognition. I guess I only really remember like landmarks. Um, um, 
I don't think I recognize that. Or do I? Wait, is that the little letter box? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. We were here before. We're gonna go up the stairs? Stair time? Uppies? It's a lot of stairs. I feel like that must go to like the city part. Yeah, so we probably wouldn't go that way. Oh man, there's graffiti in the box. I guess there really is graffiti everywhere. People just can't help themselves. Oh, we are going up the stairs. <gasps> Uppies! Okay, gotta be careful. These look really smooth, so they look really slippery. I'm glad that oh, there's like little little drains on each side. That's really nice. I like that. To have like a natural drain like that. Well, I wouldn't call it natural because obviously it's man-made, but like... I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> I wonder what this leads to, because the sun is really bright up there. So it's gonna be a surprise. Oh, oh, we need more trees. <gasps> there's another, there's another row of steps. And then trees. Is it gonna be another little park? I hope so. God, this is a lot of stairs. My legs would be killing me. <laughs> I am, I am pretty out of shape. I gotta, I gotta exercise more. I have been a little, I've been going on some walks. But now it's gotten really hot, so I don't want to go on walks anymore. Oh, oh, is this, is this a neighborhood? Oh, sign about umbrellas. Is this a neighborhood? Cause that just straight up looks like someone's house. <laughs> I love that they got plants all around though. Yeah, this looks like a... This looks like a housing area. Yep, there's a car. Is that a buggy? Cameraman, hold on! Look at that car! Yep, yep, turn more, more turn, more turn. The car's really cool. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in, Nikki. Hope you're having a good day today. We're just going on an adventure together. We're going through a, to a place in Tokyo, Japan. <gasps> Thank you for the stretch. I do need that. Oh, a different colored green traffic cone. Man, there's a lot of different types around here. Oh, car going by. Oh, wow. Very small road. Like, it looks like it could be a two lane road, but it looks more like a one lane road. Wow, I can't believe all these houses were so close to that park. I didn't even notice. Oh, another car? Ooh, it's one of those little trucks. Man, these guys are not slowing down. <laughs> With people walking on the side. I always slow down when there's someone walking. Like, even if there's a sidewalk and they're walking on the sidewalk, like right next to the road, I still slow down. Yeah, these guys don't care. They're just going. <laughs> My gosh. Such a lovely little area, though. I wish we got a better view of that really cool car. At the first house, though. Man. Even the housing part is so nice. Oh, oh, a truck is coming down. Gosh, it's kind of scary with a one lane road. Oh, nope, it's backing up. There it goes. <laughs> uh, I really like these housing areas though, they all got like plants at the front. I wish people did that here in the US. Like we'll have, we'll have plants sometimes, but we won't have like little, I wouldn't call those like in pots, but like little like areas dedicated to it. Ooh, that's a nice shade of blue for a car. I like that. <gasps> White traffic cones. This area is so nice. The, like, steel fence is kind of weird, though. I've never seen a fence like that before. Maybe it's plastic? I can't tell. I 
man, this is... It'd be so scary to drive through this. Because I don't know if any of these are one way or what. Because there's that little, like, cross there sign, like the blue and red one. I don't know what that means, though. Oh, yeah, a car coming through. Yeah, you really gotta be careful. Because there's not, it doesn't seem like there's room for two cars. Yeah, then that car's parked that way, so I guess it is a two-way road. Kind of scary, but I guess it's not very busy, so I guess it's okay. I want to look. I want to look over that fence. It looked like there was an area. <laughs> I keep, I keep lifting my head and stuff as if, as if it's gonna help me see anything any better. <laughs> Do I hear an EC, maybe? I hear something going, or maybe someone's mowing their lawn. Although it'd be weird to mow their lawn in the rain. Maybe it's just a car in the distance. Does this bring us to a new part of the park? Or is this just the end of the road? Oh, there's some big buildings over that way. I really wonder what the sign means. Because I've never seen that kind of sign around where I live, at least. Maybe it's more of a city thing? With all these, like, one-lane roads and stuff? I like how certain areas will have, like, the railway, like, or the railings for walking. Like, that always makes me feel a bit more safe. But it's weird that I'll kind of randomly have it, but honestly, that's what it's like over here in the U.S. too. Like, some parts of a road will have a sidewalk, some parts won't. I really don't know why. <laughs> probably, probably funding. Careful car. Maybe they only seem like they don't. Oh, no, I guess they're slowing down. Oh, <gasps> is that another green place? What is this? I love this, like, greenery front- fronts. Greenery fence. Like, I love when people use plants as a fence. Whether they're going, like, bushes or trees, or whatever this is. I can't tell what kind of plant this is. Sort of looks like vines, because it looks like there's some kind of fence in there. <gasps> this is another part. <gasps> is that a mailbox? Or, like, um, like, newspaper box? I haven't seen one of those in forever. Is it? Is that newspapers? Oh, I want to get closer. What is it? What is it? What is it? I think it is. I couldn't quite tell. <laughs> it went by too fast. I love the bulletin board, though, that has, like, separate places for your flyers. Like, sectioned out. That's nice. Hi, Gav. We're having a good day today. We're just exploring. This is a just area in Tokyo, Japan. We were in like a deep forest earlier. Now it looks like a park, kind of for events maybe. Oh, I think I might see a place hut. Possibly. Can't quite tell. I love the trees though. It really helps having like shade in a park. Especially in like the summer. Oh! Either the rain's picking up or the trees are dropping all of the rain from their leaves. <laughs> I wonder what's with that hill. It's kind of blocked off. What are those bumps? Is this for a game? Oh, I did see a playset! Oh my god! I wanna- I wanna try it. <laughs> I know- I'm, Oh! What's the ball thing? Does it spin? I didn't get to go to, like, playgrounds often when I was a kid. So I still want to go on them as an adult. <laughs> Even though I know I shouldn't. Oh god, I want to go on the spinny thing. <gasps> it's a hippo! A panda and an elephant. Oh my god, what's the little chicken? <laughs> He's got a spring. 
Oh my god, it's got one of those climbing things. Oh, I want to go across. I don't know if my arms are strong enough for that or not. There's swings too. Yay. I want to go on the swings. Ooh, what is that wooden area? Is that like a climbing area? Is that like exercise? I don't know what that is. Like a jungle gym kind of thing? Ooh, this is flooded. Okay, maybe I don't want to go on the swing. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, no, I'd have to... I need some good rain boots to go over there. <laughs> oh, am I gonna take a drink? <laughs> Just... Yeah, I'm gonna drink the mud water. <laughs> it's very nice, though. This is a really nice park. I wish there were parts like this around where I am. There's no good parks near me. I've never really lived near any good parks. I think I've only really lived near just other houses, I guess, or like shops. I'd love to live in like a quiet neighborhood with like a nice park like this where you can go for a walk. Like, I don't know, play something. Like, when I, where I last lived, I discovered a park nearby, like, right before I left. Because the park was literally in the middle of houses. So, like, to get to the park, you have to, like, go through someone's yard. Which is so weird. That is so weird for a park. But it was really nice, and I was so glad I found it before I left. Because it had frisbee golf. Which was really fun. Like, I just bought, like, dollar store frisbees. So, definitely not how you're supposed to play the sport. But, it's still really nice. Ooh, look at those ripples. God, that's so nice. And that's the end of that one. So next, I am going to go to... I'll be right back real quick and set up the next video. We'll only take a second. The next one, we'll do a cherry blossom walk, because I think that's gonna be really pretty. I feel like that's gonna be awesome. Alright, and then back to scene. There we go. Look at this! I have never, ever, ever been in a place with cherry blossoms before. Obviously, Japan is um, the most well-known for it. This is also a video of a place in Japan. I personally have never um, even, like, like, I know there are places in America that have stuff like this, too, but, man, it's really different when it's just a whole forest of them. And I can hear, like, like, sports in the background. I like that. Like, I like hearing other things. I like hearing people. I know that's really weird to, to say as someone who likes the forest and likes more secluded areas. But there's something about, like, hearing people that... I don't know, makes it seem more peaceful? Cause, Cause you know that other people like it at least. If that makes sense? Like... Wait, did I... Did I get rid of chat by accident? I just realized it's not on the screen. Chat bots. Okay, I think... I had a setting off by accident. Okay, we should be good now. But it's really cool to see one of these places, like, not crowded. Because whenever I see videos of, like, cherry blossom areas, it's, like, flooded with tourists. And they're always, like, shaking the branches and stuff to have the petals fall for, like, a picture. But it's nice to know that there are areas like this that's not, like, crazy crowded that still has a lot of them. Ayo, hi Cree, welcome in. Hoping you're having a good day today. We are exploring 
a uh, place in Japan right now. Some nice cherry blossoms, because I have never experienced that before. They look so pretty. I feel like there are different types too, because some of them definitely are like more vibrant than others. Like, like these ones right here look very, like very pink. But the ones by the road look a little more pastel, pastel pink. Ah, oh, they're so nice. Oh, I bet they smell so wonderful too. Oh, there's a playground here too. Wait, is there a water slide on that playground? Hold on, cameraman. Turn back. <laughs> No, I think we're going this way. Ooh, I hear like an announcement. I wonder if there's like an event going on. I think in the distance, I think I see people playing sports, maybe? Maybe it's a school or something, like a college over there? I'm putting my hands up as if it's going to help me look further. <laughs> I wonder if there's a school over there. Oh, got some sirens. Someone's in trouble. Someone's in trouble. Don't feel bad. Just chilling. How about you? I'm glad you're doing good. I'm doing great because my stream didn't work last night, which made me really sad. I was really glad I got to um, join uh, Rin for a bit, but my stream didn't work because my internet was bad. I was going to do this last night, but we're doing it today and I've, I've wanted to do this kind of stream for so long because I love walking through parks, I love like exploring new places, and I really wanted to experience that with you guys. So this is literally like how I would be if you were actually like walking with me in a place. I probably like touch things more, but obviously uh, I am I am a virtual being, so I can't can't do that right now. But I'd love to like sit in the grass, uh, maybe have something to eat or drink. Oh, like, oh, like having like lemonade or iced tea under the cherry blossoms. That'd be so nice. God, like even just having these like along like the parking area. Like, yo, I'd just sit here next to the parking spaces. <laughs> Sounds great, yeah. Look at that crow. That's a pretty big crow. <laughs> Hi, buddy. You're not running away. <gasps> Do I see a doggy in the distance? Or is that a bench? I can't tell. I feel like that person has a dog. Right? Maybe? Right? Or is that a rock? What is that other shape? No, it's moving. It's a dog! Do I have a dog? <gasps> Doggy! Oh my god, what type of doggy is that? Oh, is that a chow? What are you? Golden Retriever maybe? Or like a mix? It's a little too blurry to see. Oh, look at these tiny little benches. Oh, so we can look out the pond over there. I wonder if these trees with the buds on them, I wonder if those are unblossomed cherry blossoms? Oh, I can hear the wind. I love when it's just a little windy. Ooh, someone's taking a run. You can do it, man. Good job. Or lady. Whoever you are. <laughs> are those dandelions? I love the tiny flowers. And that one is nice. Yeah. It doesn't get windy where I live that much. But it's so nice when there is wind. Like just sitting in the grass. Oh, like that guy over there by the pond. Just sitting, chilling. I wonder if he's fishing. No, I think there's a bench over there. I think he's just chilling. I think I heard another dog. <laughs> Maybe they were sort of really squeaky shoes. <laughs> God, look at that giant building next to it, though. I assume it's like an apartment complex. God, imagine looking at this park every day. 
Oh, that'd be so nice. I'd be horrified living in the upper levels, though. Like, I'm really bad with heights. <laughs> or, like, building heights, at least. Oh, hear a little bell. Hi, Azzy. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day today. We're just exploring. Uh, we're exploring a park in Japan right now. Checking out the cherry blossoms. Because I've never done that before. Demi, where were you? I'm doing great. I was going to do the stream yesterday, but it didn't work. So I'm doing this today. And if my voice is up for it, I'm going to be doing karaoke after. So we got... Maybe I'll do to the end of this video, so maybe like half an hour-ish, and then we'll start some karaoke. I have some lemonade with me. Oh man, my ice cube melted. Oh, that's so nice though. It's not cold anymore, but it's still nice. It's not fresh lemonade, it's just like, um... That powdered mix that you can buy. I've never made fresh lemonade before because lemons are pretty expensive. Ooh, what's over there? What is that? What is that white stuff? Is that just piles of rocks? <laughs> Trying to make me want some soda. <laughs> yeah, man, I'm thirsty. It's really hot. I have a um, I have a cooling pad that I had in the freezer, but it's lost most of its cold by now. But where I am, it's like, I feel like it's probably in the 90s by now. Or no, yeah, it was like, it's nearly 100 earlier. And sadly, my AC is on the other side of the house. So my office is pretty warm. 88 there, yeah, that's hot. Yeah, I don't know what it is right now, but... Is this kind of like a... Is this to slow down the river? I've never seen something like that before. I assume you're not allowed to walk in the grass. Like, it doesn't look like it's managed to look super pretty or something. Is anyone here? Ooh! Yeah, it's supposed to get over 100. Um, either tomorrow or the next day. I think it's tomorrow. It's gonna be awful. But I'm gonna do my best anyways. I'm gonna die, I know. I feel that. Like, I'm really trying not to use the AC too much. Obviously because it's expensive and I'm not doing, not doing that great right now. So, really gotta penny pinch where I can. But, I can't not have it because I don't want to obviously I don't want to have heat stroke and I obviously don't want my my kitty to have a heat stroke oh that was a fan and sing to does my head oh that sucks I'm sorry about that yeah I only have an AC because it was given to me I only got it I only had an AC when I first moved in because Mama Hen didn't want me to have a heat stroke when it was like 100 degrees. I was pretty close to it. I was like sweating my butt off. I had a fan and I was staying hydrated. But it's like I couldn't do anything. Because there's something about heat where I just kind of become useless. <laughs> like, I don't, I don't know why. Well, obviously because it's rough to function when your body's overheating but like when I'm cold I can do okay like I can I can work on things really well when I'm, when I'm cold like I can just bundle up but when it's hot you can't bundle down any further really like you can't you can't take your skin off <laughs> like there's only so much you can do when it's hot and it's like that's why I live where I do right now because I lived in a really, really hot place um, for a few years where it was like minimum like 80 degrees Fahrenheit like all year and summer would go up to like 130. It was death. 
but um, I moved back up north where I belong because I'm a bear and we got fur and we, we need the cold so that we don't die. It's no problem doing summer. I hate it. Oh, I feel that. Yeah, I'm glad I'm not in school anymore either. Well, that doesn't mean I'm not studying. I'm still, still working hard so I can uh, learn how to provide better content for you guys. How to draw better. How to just be a better um, like content creator in general. I watch so many things about like marketing and stuff and like how to um is that another doggy hold on yay look at them look at them wagging their tail they're so happy <laughs> um but yeah i always i always um watch uh like youtube tutorials and stuff on just how to do better as a content creator if that makes sense like how to properly tag, how to properly like post, um, like what algorithm changes or whatever are happening with like YouTube or something. It's really hard to keep track of it all and I definitely am not utilizing everything I can, but I'm doing my best. I really wish TikTok still worked because I feel like that did really well, but Maybe I should just make a new one. <laughs> Maybe I should just delete my TikTok and make a new one and hope that I'm not shadow banned on it anymore. Kind of feel bad though, because one of my. I've been using TikTok. <laughs> yeah, it's like I don't like it. I don't like shorts compared to long form stuff. But that's how I've grown the most, it seems. Like I'm putting out a short every day on YouTube. Like it's just a small thing. Just a small little, like, oh, do you like this or that and stuff like that. But I've really started to grow since then. Like, I'm, I obviously haven't, like, blown up or anything. But I've gotten a cons consistent amount of followers. Like, I used to get a follower once in a blue moon. But now I'm getting new followers every week. And that's so wild to me. It makes me so happy that I can reach more people and make more people happy. Help more people. <gasps> See the flowers in the grass? It's so pretty. God, this is such a nice area. I have an account too, just deleted the app. Yeah, I don't use it too much anymore because I don't like, I don't know, it's definitely not good for me because I, I have some of the Andrew follow Dang, I only have like, I don't even have 400 followers on TikTok, I think. Um, but, um, yeah, it's like I mostly see like cooking videos, like animals, um, and then like content creation advice. Um, animals, always really cute. I love seeing people's pets. <gasps> Are these dinosaur scales? <gasps> Is this a stegosaurus scales? And like rocks to look like it or something? Oh my god, I love this. Oh my god, I love this. <laughs> This is so silly, but it's so nice. I was popular once. I like that. That was a nice little thing for this park to have. Oh my god, there's like another- there's like a shell thing over there? This is so nice. But yeah, I'm doing my best to, to grow so that I can hopefully do this for a living someday. I'm definitely nowhere near it right now because <laughs> I think like, I think I average maybe like 40 maybe $50 a month on Twitch I'm not even monetized yet on YouTube so I make nothing from YouTube um, I don't make anything on Twitter because I think you need like, a certain amount of followers or something and then you start getting like a dollar every thousand views or something like that I don't I don't remember how that works, but I'm definitely not there for that yet. And I don't get too many commissions. If I'm lucky, I get like a commission a week. Or like, it's usually more like 
I'll get like three commissions at once and then I won't have anything for like a week or two and then all of a sudden it'll be like two people or something but they're still mostly mostly smaller things so like the only reason I made a good amount this past month was because I was commissioned for a VTuber model which obviously is a lot and that really helped me I am that, that was a big relief but my rent will be going up in a couple months well in a month actually so it's gonna be a little harder but everything's going up honestly so it's not a surprise wish you the best hope your dreams come true thank you i'm doing my best so that it happens i'm not giving up even though things are tough right now i'm still doing my best to stream for you guys and make videos and stuff. I've gotten some help lately uh, with some shorts, so hopefully I will be able to have um, some nice um, like video game clip kind of things instead of just my little silly <gasps> I love this seating area instead of uh, my little silly like what do you like kind of videos I was thinking of even doing like good morning um and good night shorts maybe because i know a lot of vtubers will just like tweet or like announce in their discord oh we teleported <laughs> uh like good morning or good night but i think it'd be fun to like vocally greet you guys or wish you guys good night or even like maybe at lunchtime be like oh what are you guys having for lunch i'm having a ham sandwich or like an egg salad what is that house what is that funky house what is that i want oh i'm so glad we're going towards it that's so funky what is this it looks like a little mushroom house i hear everyone playing sports nearby <gasps> is this someone's house like straight up <laughs> or can we go through that We really got some sports going on. God, I want to power wash that so bad. Oh, I want to get closer. I want to get closer. <laughs> It'd be kind of weird if this was straight up someone's house, though. It's got to be like a garden kind of thing. We're not going towards it, are we? Those are some funky benches. Yeah, these are some weird benches. What is this? <laughs> See the mushroom? Yeah, it did look like a mushroom. That looks like an area to keep wood, maybe? Maybe for the winter or something? <gasps> What's that little tower thing? What is that? What is this house? Is this a shop? <gasps> is this a cafe or something? <gasps> I want ice cream! Mm, I want ice cream. <laughs> Oh, nope. Teleported towards this little area. This is so cute. Does it just have stairs directly into the water? <laughs> hey, B, are we actually in Japan or just somewhere in a simulator? Oh, this is actually Japan. Also, sorry for hearing some noises. My landlord is doing something. Oh my god, there's like a little river coming from the mushroom house. <gasps> Does this seriously just lead right into the river? Can you open Is that locked? Can you open it? Oh, okay, I think it's locked. Um, I love- Yeah, it just looks like it just goes directly into the river. <laughs> Ice cream, what taste? Oh, uh, I don't know. I want to try something new. It's been so long since I've had ice cream. Or like, tried different flavors. <sighs> Oh, I want ice cream so bad. Oh, I want ice cream so bad. <laughs> but I shouldn't. I shouldn't. I'm trying to... I want a budget right now. I shouldn't ice cream. Mm, but I want ice cream. Mm. <laughs> so hot. Oh, is that another funky bench? What is that shape? That is a weird shape. <laughs> Is that a birdhouse? 
a lamp, maybe? <gasps> Thank you for the follow. Sukuna, welcome in. Just got a Korean ad for Ija, man. I don't know what that is. <laughs> Let's get some. Oh, I do want some. <laughs> we'll get some virtual ice cream. <laughs> virtual ice cream is free, at least. <laughs> oh. I feel like this might be towards the end of this. Oh, skincare? Oh, I don't have. Oh, <gasps> what is this? Wait, are we in the house? Guys, I think we're in the mushroom house. Oh my god, what is this? We're, look at these little guys. Are these ghosts and like demons and stuff? <gasps> is this a spooky house? Oh. Yeah, we're, to we're totally in the mushroom house. <gasps> Whoa, the inside's crazy. Are those just terrariums? And then there's like a place to wash and stuff? <gasps> or is this not the mushroom house? What is this? I don't remember this area from the mushroom house. Is this just like a parking area? Or something? What is this? This is weird. This is very weird. Is this the back of the mushroom house? What the heck is going on? This is so cool. <laughs> And the ghosts were cute. They were. I love little ghosties. Okay. Okay. First well. <laughs> Get those teeth clean. Intrusive thoughts are telling me to poke the belly. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No. We weren't in the mushroom house because the mushroom house has a river right behind it. We were somewhere different. What the heck? Are we gonna go to the mushroom house now? Some nice flowers. Is there another? There's another funky bench. I don't know what this place is, but it's so artsy. I like it. I've never really found a place like this in the U.S. At least. So like, where is this? Looks like New Zealand. This is um uh by the Irima River in Japan, um next to the uh, Akebono Children's Forest Park. So that is what this is. So this is somewhere in Japan. I remember it's doing something. I don't know if that's picking up for you guys. But I think he's like fixing the sink upstairs. Doing something with it. Yeah, there you go. There's some Japanese characters. Yeah, mu mushroom house. Something no something. I don't I don't know many Japanese characters. Oh, I think it's closed. Or are we in a different place? Did we teleport? Did we teleport somewhere? Oh, they probably- we probably weren't allowed to have cameras inside. There's a lot of places like that. That's a funky bench. Oh my god, if he's missing ink on... Like, sounded like it was. Um, no, it's a, um... You know those hoses that the sinks come with? Because the sink upstairs, uh, the- the hose part was broken. So I think he's testing it out and putting a new one in. But yeah, that's the um the sprayer. That's the sprayer for the for the dishes. I don't know if all all countries have that. The noisy ones that you pull. Yeah, that's that's yeah, that's what it was. But yeah, I have I have one of those, but the upstairs one was broken for a long time, so I guess he decided to fix it today or put a new one in today. <laughs> right now because <laughs> he's doing a lot of um fixing and stuff because he might sell the place and i'm really hoping that wh whoever winds up buying the place doesn't hike up the rent a bunch hello hi gonzo welcome in we are exploring a park in japan right now it's pretty cool there's some funky stuff and you can hear- you can hear my landlord messing with the sink upstairs. Because <laughs> it's directly above me. Let's see, what is today? Okay, yeah, it's Tuesday. Yeah, he usually works on these days. Dang it. 
I thought because he did a little work yesterday. Oh, and that was the end of that one. <laughs> but yeah, that was we got to saw we got to see cherry blossoms in this park, and we got to see we got to see like a rainy rainy area, um, in the by the river. I do have uh, one more video saved. It's another uh, walking in the rain one. I don't know where it is. Um, it doesn't say. It's just another, um, it's just like an area. I think it's more of a European looking area at least. But, um, I feel like we should stick to that because I was originally going to do karaoke today. But it's really hot. <laughs> and I know if I do karaoke, I'm going to get all fired up and I'm going to be like moving around and stuff. And I'm not going to want to... <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna be so miserable. I'm gonna be so sweaty if I do that. I'm gonna, oh, I might pass out if I do that. So let's, um, but I, oh, I still want to do the karaoke though. What do you think? What do you think? Because my, my cooling pad is out of cool. I do have some more lemonade though. Um, oh god, it's so hot. <laughs> yeah, I think, yeah, I think I'm gonna have to move the karaoke. Let's do the last, um, let's do to the last park that I got prepared for us. And, um, you know, if it's a little cooler, then maybe, maybe I'll, um, I'll go to karaoke. But for now... Um, this one specifically says, like, ambience and stuff, but it's still, like, a nice walk through an area. But this seems more like either an American area or maybe European. I'm really bad at telling where something is. I'm not very, what is it called, traveled. Um, I've never left my area, really. <laughs> so... I don't, I don't know places, because <laughs> there are some people that are like, oh, this is this kind of plant, and this kind of plant only grows in this area. I'm not like that. <laughs> so I'm just like, oh, pretty. <laughs> pretty place. Pretty area. <laughs> Hi, Riv. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day today. We're, we're adventuring together. Maybe. Maybe I should put in the stream title, like, rainy. Oh, I can't do it right now, apparently. Why not? How about now? There's a plant I haven't touched grass since- oh my gosh. Um, save. There's nothing to save. Why do you always use that? Why do you always do that? <laughs> We're literally just walking through a forest. What are we gonna save? But also, hello, Nia Sensei, welcome in. <laughs> Hope you're having a good day today. Hope everyone's having a good day. What do you mean? Don't worry about it. <laughs> uh, just open the menu and see if there's no menu. This is literally like Windows Media Player. Uh, my cooling pad is almost completely out of cold. <sighs> at least, at least this rain will cool me down. <laughs> screenshot. Oh, hello, Tom and Jerry! You're here! <laughs> Welcome in, back. Oh, I hope, I hope your, your teeth brushing went well. Hope you got nice shiny teeth now. Sorry, I played too much. BDO, BDO, what is that? I'm finally free for a little bit. BDO. Um, trying to think of games I know that start with B. Borderlands, Battle Block, nice rainy sounds. Yeah, we started off with rainy sounds, so I wanted to end off with it too. Just nice, comfy, cozy, cozy walk together. Make sure you stay under the umbrella so you don't get wet. I don't want you guys to uh, get a cold while we're out here. <laughs> like this night. Oh, I forgot about that. I haven't heard about that game in a long time. Oh my god, this one is like, 
I feel like this is definitely, it's gotta be some place in America, right? Like, I feel like I recognize some of this foil, foil, foilage, foil, foil, foilage, foilage, foil, why does this, I feel like I'm saying that wrong, foilage, foil, foilage, to remind you that it is a good game, <laughs> thank you, thank you for the reminder, trees, yes, the trees are good, nice green, green good, green nice, I like, yes, <laughs> but this is like a tar path like i feel like i feel like this is america because i feel like america does these kind of paths all the time where they just like tar like a path through the forest and that's it like because with the japanese one they had like little stones and there's like wooden paths and it was so nice but here in america we're just like just tar Tar through it and that's it. <laughs> it is still nice though, like I still enjoy it. Because it's nice that all the trees are like really close too. Cause I feel like a lot of paths they'll like clear next to it as well. Cause it is has like a little bit cleared next to it. But it still very much is like straight up the middle of the forest. <laughs> I love it. It's so nice. So, so nice. I wish it was raining in the real life where I am. God, it would cool down so much. But now it's like 90 something. It's death outside. <laughs> right, all the nature trails I've taken are paid for biking. Oh, yeah, for biking. That's why I forgot about that. Yeah, it's like if I go deeper in the mountains, it's usually just dirt. Hi, Essig. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day today. We're just adventuring through the forest together. But yeah, I totally forgot that people bike. Because I know there are specific, like, bike areas. Like, bike trails. Bike, bike paths or whatever. But, um... Like, there's this one park I like going to that has, like, a playground and stuff. Um, and, like, areas for, like, sports and things. But then it has like a paved path through the forest and then it has a dirt path that goes like way deeper in the forest and it's it's so nice i like the dirt path because they usually i don't know you're just more immersed in nature i guess oh this is a lake is that a boat what is that i see is that a stump car no that's a car right i can't quite tell from here i put my hand you know how when people <laughs> You know how when people look out for something, they put their hand, like, where their eyebrows are, and, like, squint? I just did that. And I know it's not gonna help, but I did that anyways. <laughs> I'm like, hmm, maybe I'll see that car questionable object better if I put my, put my hand above my eyes to, to block the sun and squint. <laughs> uh, silly me. Silly me. Alright, what do we got? What do we got? Oh, yeah, okay, so it is a car. And a house? Someone's house, maybe? Parking lot? I don't know. Oof, the rain is pouring. I like it. Cause I like when it's raining like this. Like, it's raining hard, but it's not like, it's not like thunderstorms. It's not like crazy winds and stuff. Like, you can still go out. And still enjoy the rain and it's not like so light that it's just like sprinkling but it's still like you know like it's it's raining and it's a nice time i really should probably get a good umbrella though because i have i think three umbrellas one of them the handle is broken the handle broke off because it's really old uh, and the other two I think one of them, uh, the wind broke it, I think, so like, uh, I have to pull, I have to pull the umbrella down, um, one of its, what are those called, like, fingers, I guess? I don't know how else to describe the wiring on an umbrella, <laughs> but I gotta, like, pull it down, and I think the third one is okay, 
but it's like a free one that I got from like a company. And it's weird walking around with an object that just has like a company brand on it. That's not like a clothing brand. I feel like a lot of like my pens especially are like random like banks and stuff. Hello Tiger Shark, welcome in. Hope you're having a good day today. We're just exploring through a forest together because I just love taking walks and I really wanted to go on a walk with you guys. And it's so nice. It's so, so nice. I love exploring. I love seeing nature. Oh, someone's house. Does this, wait, does this path just lead to someone's house? Or is someone's, oh no, no, no. Okay, the path goes the other way. <laughs> I was worried for a second. I was like, all right, does this path just go into someone's like living room? <laughs> oh, there is a path towards it though. Are we gonna- where- wh which way are we going? We're at an impasse. Which way? Okay. I don't think we're going to the house. Okay, good. <laughs> That'd be so weird. <laughs> oh, I think the rain is either letting up or maybe the trees are covering. Maybe the trees are covering, so we're not getting as much rain down to us. Hi, Patrick. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day today. We are exploring nature. Probably a community building? Maybe. Because, like, some paths uh, that I go down are just near people's houses. So, even though I walk down the path, I can still see someone's house <laughs> or someone's yard. Yeah, I feel like this is definitely America. Where are you going, cameraman? What is this? <laughs> what are we looking at? A little stream! Imagine, yes, excuse me, I'm recording a video, don't mind me, it says entering the living room. <laughs> yeah, we just, they just have their window open, and we just, we just go through the window, walk through the house, and then, like, go out a different window. <laughs> oh, nice little stream. Um, one of my uncles had a stream like this by his house. He's been dead for a while now, though, sadly. And I'm really upset because my uncle really loved his, like, he built his house uh, himself, obviously got, like, some help for it, but, um, built it himself, paved the driveway and everything himself. He took really, really good care of the yard. Like, he loved his home, he loved his yard, but the people who bought it after he died do not take care of it whatsoever. Like, the bushes... Uh, are mostly dead. There's like weeds and stuff all over the yard. Like they just don't mow. Or like they only mow like a part of it or something. I don't know. It makes me so sad. Like I literally want to go over and be like, please, can I just mow your lawn? Like, please, can I just, can I just clean up your yard like a little bit? Because the reason why um, it was sold to the people it was is because they had a kid and um my uncle's house had a nice yard and a, a decent driveway and stuff so kid can play sports play outside have a basketball hoop and things could play like soccer or whatever um so we sold sold it to those people so that um there could their kid could have a enriched uh childhood but nah it's just it's just all achy now Looks like the large parks here, mostly fat, but lots of trees and creeks. Also a billion mosquitoes. Yeah. I feel like That's why I feel like this is definitely somewhere in America. Because the video, I'm pretty sure it doesn't say. Because it's under, like, oh. Um. Ambient. Rain and stuff. <laughs> but there are some of these videos that are like a couple hours long i just wanted to do a couple like short ones first just so that we could see like different areas like in a, i guess in a shorter amount of time like I'd, I'd love to do one of these that's just like three hours long and we're going through like a mountain trail or something that'd be really cool but uh i wanted to start out with just some short ones just to just to try out these kinds of streams i want to make sure that you guys like it because 
if I'm streaming only for myself, that's kind of pointless. I'm here to, I'm here to have fun with you guys and share things with you guys. And I'm glad that you guys seem to really like it. A good amount of you guys are hanging around. It makes me really happy because I just love... Oh, there's cracks. That's probably where some tree roots have been growing. <laughs> Yeah, I'm really glad that you guys are, are hanging. I think this is up North America. This is how I remember Pennsylvania being. Maybe it is Pennsylvania. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, I don't really see any tropical plants. Like I'm not seeing no like palm tree kind of things. And it seems pretty lush, so I don't think it's like a deserty area. So yeah, maybe you're right. I don't know. I'm not one to recognize different types of trees or plants. I'm just like, oh, that's a tree. That's some grass. <laughs> but yeah, I can definitely like download more of these videos from YouTube. But the only reason I don't play it directly from YouTube is just in case YouTube decides to be a poopy butthead and uh, like stick an ad in between or something. I don't want to, I don't want to interrupt our experience. <laughs> so I downloaded downloaded some videos. Man, that tree's been cut down for a while. That thing is pretty dead. That's like the perfect log. Oh my god. Oh my god, that log is so perfect. Did you did you see that? Like, it was just the perfect straight log. Like, the perfect size that you get in, like, video games and stuff. Like, that was the perfect log. <laughs> I say, oh yeah, that's another thing. Like if, if I was able to like actually, um, like take you guys on a walk, like you'd see me picking up like sticks and rocks and stuff that I think are cool. <laughs> Cause I'm always like, ooh, pretty. And then I like take it home with me and then I get home and I'm like, why do I have this? <laughs> like I'll keep it for a little bit, but then I'll just put it back outside. I'm like, no. This doesn't belong in the house. <laughs> like so certain rocks I'll keep if they're like really, really cool. But sticks I usually bring back outside. Especially if it's like a really long stick. Part of the adventure. Yeah, like I'll, I'll have like a hiking stick that I'll, I'll, I'll use for that walk and then I'll set it back down before I leave. Or like, um... I don't know, just... A, a stick that it like looks like a sword. I'll just like play around with that for a bit and put it back. Like I could tell that I was uh, seen as strange when I had a field trip. I think my senior year of high school uh, for science, and we went out in nature, and um. I found a stick, and I I play sword fight sword fight with the stick, and there are so many sticks of that uh, caliber <laughs> around, and no one else picked up a stick to sword fight. No one else did. And I was like, man, why why are people no fun? <laughs> I feel like not many people, uh. I guess stay fun when they become an adult. Like a lot of people, they're like, "Oh, I gotta, I gotta grow up. I gotta, I can't like these kinds of things no more." Okay, I'm getting Louisiana vibes, so I'm really lost where this is. I have no clue. I, I just assume just somewhere America. We're in, we're in John America. <laughs> somewhere. Somewhere in America. Don't know where. <laughs> oh, it's so pretty though. What is, what is that? It looks like kind of fluffy, ferny plants. What is that? Is that a bush? Are those a bunch of ferns? No, look the other direction. I'm looking. I'm trying to look the other direction, please. <laughs> other side. Other side. No, not gonna show me the other side. I know there's a creek over there. Happy hydrogen. Hi, Brian Cthulhu. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day today. I'm doing great. 
I was going to do the stream yesterday, but my internet wasn't working, so I'm doing it today. So I'm really happy. Because I really love, uh, yeah, I really love going to parks and stuff. And I really wanted to share that experience with you guys. So we're adventuring. Ooh, look at that stump. We still got the tiny stream going. We still got the tiny stream going. I know what most is the east coast. The eastern part of America is more greenery. But aren't there? You're actually out? No, this isn't this isn't actually me. This is a recording. <laughs> no, this is um this is uh just a video I downloaded on YouTube. Um we were in um I have no clue how my VTuber model would work if I was actually out. Um, you know, we were looking at um, VTuber, not VTuber, why, why, I'm, I'm mixing up my words. We were looking at like places in Japan earlier. And VTubers actually go out. <laughs> Imagine, nah, I'm virtual, I gotta stay in the computer. So I can only go outside through the computer. <laughs> Ooh, another fallen tree. Oh, we're heading... We got a U-turn, so maybe we're heading back to where we started. But yeah, I'm doing really good. I'm glad that we were able to stream this. Because I love, I love looking at new places and stuff. <gasps> Look at that tunnel of just greenery ahead. Oh, that's so perfect. When I was little, um, I wanted to live uh, outside but inside if that makes sense. Like in a lot of video games, there are like indoor areas that still have like trees and grass and stuff and it still looks really sunny and things, but it's still like inside. But it's not just like a greenhouse. So it's like I want I I want to live in a place like that, but I know that in order to have greenery indoors, it has to be a greenhouse. And greenhouses are so hot. Oh my god. Like I went I went into a greenhouse like the first time, maybe the first time ever, or maybe it was just the first time in so many years that I can't remember the first time, but like last year, uh, me and Mama Hen, we went to like a farm just to look at stuff, and they had a little greenhouse area, and it was so hot, <laughs> like it was, I'm pretty sure it was still the summer, so it was like maybe uh like mid 70s lower 80s outside but in that greenhouse it felt like a hundred it was ugh, I, ugh, it was awful it was death like i could only be inside the greenhouse for like a couple minutes because i was probably like a bit dehydrated and i got dizzy so easy so i don't think i could ever live inside a greenhouse as much as I'd love to have greenery inside my house, well, I, I doubt I'll ever be able to afford a house, but it's still, I can, I can dream. I can, I can pretend I'm little me again that still has those dreams. Oh, jeez. I am like desperately holding onto my cooling bed, hoping for it to cool me. <laughs> it's out of the cool. It's just about out of the cool. And even though I got a drink and stuff, I am a little dizzy. But I still kind of want to go for karaoke anyways. Because <laughs> I really wanted to do that this week. And I really want to like take advantage while my internet is working right. <laughs> I really want to just, like, go for it. Ooh, okay, that sign is in English. So we are definitely, definitely in a, in a English-speaking place. Oh, and I think we're headed back to that car area. So yeah, we're probably, we're probably almost through, almost through this area. Or almost finished with this video. Because this one, I think, was the shortest of the three. But yeah, it's been so nice exploring with you guys. A nice walk too, yeah. It was a decent, decent, yeah, like a half hour walk. Yeah, now that I think about it, because I usually go for a 10 
to half an hour walk. Um, now and then I'll go for a really long one, so like an hour or two. But those make my legs really sore, because <laughs> I'm out of shape. I used to have such strong legs, because I used to be center offense for soccer, and I could I could go for I could go for hours. But after becoming adult, going to college and studying all day, and then going directly to work after at a desk job, <laughs> uh, I've lost I've lost a lot of my muscle. But I'll get it back. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm working on it slowly, very slowly. Cause I just got back into taking walks cause the, the weather got really nice, but now it's like so deadly hot outside. So I don't want to go on walks, but like I should probably, I should probably, um, get my ring fit going again. Cause I was doing that earlier in the year. So maybe I should get back to my ring fit. Cause I just reset up. Oh, were you recording with? Um Oh, the do you mean the actual video? That's not that's not mine. I just got that from YouTube. But if you mean um like what I'm streaming with, I use Streamlabs. <laughs> Oh yeah, no, this is not my this is not my video. It's just it's something on YouTube so that we can explore something together. Yeah, I would never I don't have the the money to get like a really good um camera and stuff to like go outside. I probably wouldn't either cuz that would that would kind of dox me. <laughs> Which is bad. I don't want to do that. <laughs> Yeah, I don't have anything this interesting around me. Like, I do live kind of near some mountains, which is sort of nice. We were talking like you went to that place already. No, no. <laughs> um, just similar places, I guess. Because I feel like most places in America, they like pave this kind of area. Uh, or pave like a path to the forest. And, um... Yeah, so I've I've been on trails similar to this, I guess. Oh, and there there it goes. That is that is the end of that one.